Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video we are going to talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the release preview channel. So this week we have the third update for Windows 11. We had an update for the main release, also an update for the dev and the beta channels of the Windows Insider program. And now finally we have another update for the release preview channel which will most likely get into the main release after a week. This is basically an update that would normally be released for the beta and release preview channels but because my Microsoft is now releasing builds for both dev and beta. We now have a Windows 11 update only for the release preview channel. So of course in this video I'm going to show you what is new in this update, what is fixed and stuff like that so that you can make a better idea of what to expect from this build if you are in the release preview channel or if you're on the main release what you're going to see in about a week time. Before doing anything please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel if you enjoy videos like these where I talk about new Windows 11 updates or builds for the main release or for the Windows Insider program. So let's continue with the video. This build that was released today is the build 22,000.651. And as I've said, it was released for the release preview channel from the Windows Insider program. First of all, in this build, Microsoft added improvements for servicing the secure boot component of Windows. And they also fixed an issue that causes the AppX deployment service to stop working after you install certain M6 apps. So this was quite a known error that was coming up when you were installing installing M6 apps or you were manually installing them using PowerShell, you could get an error or that component could stop working and that should now be fixed. And they also fixed a rare condition that occurs early in the startup process that might cause a stop error. So basically, if you've ever gotten that error, now you should no longer receive it. Also, another note for Microsoft is that they fixed an issue that delays OS startup by approximately 40 minutes. I'm not really sure what they mean by 40 minutes, but I'm thinking thinking that a lot of startups accumulated can get up to 40 minutes in about a month's time or something like that. I don't know, but certainly they improved the OS startup in Windows 11. And also another thing, Microsoft is now displaying the temperature on the top of the weather icon on the taskbar. Also, they fixed an issue that prevents you from using the minimize, maximize and close buttons on a maximized app window. This issue occurs because the notification center keeps the input focus and now this should be fixed. Basically, these are the most important additions or changes in this build. It is a very small build, as you've guessed, but there are still other fixes and other changes that are more technical. And if you're interested in those, you can have access to them in the article down below in the video's description. This was today's build from Microsoft for the release preview channel. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. That was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.